Okay, let's talk about ivory and why the ignorant person like me would not know why you would not use ivory on keys. Right. Well, ivory comes from elephants, and uh, elephants are already uh, in, uh, in enough trouble in, in Africa and under enough pressure from, uh, from population growth and farming, never mind poachers who would illegally kill them and then get the, uh, get the ivory uh, uh, certified as being, uh, being I don't know, eco-friendly or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, just, I just can't imagine killing such a wonderful animal just to make a, a keyboard. So, uh, our keyboards are made from, from the shin bones of cows, this, this bone in a cow, mm -hmm. and uh, there's plenty of cows, and they're, <laughs> they're a renewable resource. And um, they're provided by a supplier in Boston, whose name I wish I could tell you, but I can't, mm -hmm. uh, to ourselves. And they are the covering on the keys, on the keyboard, the keyboards come into our shop as big pieces of rough lumber, which are milled to thickness and cut to shape, and covered with the uh, ivory pieces. The ivory, there we go. You can splice that. Out. <laughs> covered with the cow bone pieces, uh, which come come from uh, the supplier. And then they're finished, polished, all in house. So. Every so you don't tickle the ivories anymore. You tickle the, the cow bones. We tickle the cow bones. Yeah, right. there we go. <laughs> all right, that's a good little story that's right there. And uh, all right, well, what, where should we go now? So, um, it, why don't we go inside the organ? Fantastic. If, Let's go. Yeah. And, uh,